Hey, what's up, BOVC users? Eric here, aka Weirbot, my gamer tag. And uh, I'm bringing you the first of what will hopefully be many uh, zombies tutorials for the YouTube channel here. And uh, this first one is going to be about the first three rounds of any game of zombies and what to do and how to maximize your points. Uh, I'm playing on Ascension right now. Uh, just because it's the newest map, it's also my favorite. I really, really like Ascension. Um, so we'll dive right in. Right now I'm running around showing you guys the four zombie entrances that are in this uh, starting room. That was the, uh, the first uh, little hole in the handrail there. That's the second hole. Uh, you can jump down uh, through those holes. Um, unlike the catwalk on five, uh, you can jump through that you can't get over. You can jump through those holes uh, here in the centrifuge room on ascension. Uh, the zombies can also jump up uh, from the ground through those little uh, holes in the handrail there, which uh, can can be a pain sometimes. But um, so yeah, the technique for the first three rounds. Basically, uh, the first three rounds are important in any game of zombies because you want to maximize the number of points that you have. Uh, that way you can make uh, big moves, open up many doors, uh, and get to important things like turning on the power, finding the mystery box, that sort of, sort of thing. Uh, and also, it's uh, easy to kill the zombies here in the first three rounds, um, so uh, it's, it's easy to rack up a lot of points if you know what to do. So, uh, the general technique is what we call the 5 plus 1, or the uh, 5 bullets plus a knife technique. And um, basically what you're going to do, you'll see me do it to this guy right here. Um, shoot four bullets at the zombie, uh, which, uh, four or five. In the first round, sometimes five will kill him, so I kind of go four, but after the first round, it's, it's always five. Um, shoot five bullets at the zombie, that will put them uh, right on the brink of death, and then you go in for the knife. And the reason you do this is uh, because of the way zombies are scored. Uh, you get 10 points for every non-lethal hit on a zombie, and then you get 60 points for a lethal shot to the torso or chest, and 50 points for a uh, lethal shot to one of the limbs, arms or legs on a zombie. But if you knife the zombie to kill it, you get 130 points. So by putting five non-lethal bullets that gets you 50 points and then uh, the knife to kill them gets you 100 gets you 130 so that's 180 points per zombie if you do that right um, so that's a lot of points in the first three rounds that you can rack up by doing this um, so as you can see I'm trying to use this technique on these guys right here and right there um, was something really really critical uh, what you're gonna wanna do because this technique uses a lot of ammo. You're putting, you know, at least five shots on every zombie. Uh, you're going to run out of ammo pretty quick in your 1911. So what you're going to want to do is let them in, uh, because the only way that they'll drop uh, power ups and perks like that is uh, when they're inside of the room. They won't drop them, you know, out in their hallways or when they're climbing over these little zombie entrances here. So let them in and then kill them once they're inside, that way they drop power-ups and what you're looking for is a max ammo, uh, which you saw I just got a second ago there. And uh, once you have a max ammo, you're pretty much set and it should be pretty easy to continue doing this technique for three rounds. And uh, yeah, the other thing to talk about here, uh, specifically to Ascension, is this centrifuge in the middle of the room here. As you saw a second ago, um, uh, an alarm sounds and then that centrifuge will actually start spinning and um, if you are standing uh, or you have any regular zombies that aren't aren't turned into crawlers yet uh, that centrifuge will take you out it will down you um, if you're playing on if you're playing on your own and you get hit with the centrifuge uh, you're done um, here I'm trying to make a crawler and get out I got really lucky there I don't know how I didn't get down made a couple of crawlers there then the uh, centrifuge spun up like I was talking about took out that other zombie so right now I've got a crawler and I'm just gonna run around check and make sure he's the last guy uh, generally you wanna try and get a crawler in round three. Oh, there's that last guy up there on the catwalk he just jumped down so uh, go ahead and take this guy out and uh, actually I'm gonna sneak up on him from behind um, and I believe I end this three rounds with 3,950 points, which is 
a lot of points for uh, just three rounds on solo. So there you go. That's the technique.